welcome to the Droid Guy channel. This video demonstrates the process of clearing cache and data from an app on the Galaxy Note 20. Keep watching to learn what to do in case any of your Note 20 apps goes rogue and doesn't work as intended. Android devices, including Samsung Galaxy smartphones, do embed a dedicated tool to manage built-in and downloaded applications. Such a tool is called Application Manager, which can be accessed through the Settings menu. Figuring out where and how to access the phone's app manager is imperative, given that any of the phone apps can become glitchy at some point. This is often the case if some corrupted cached files are stored in an app. To prevent such problems from transpiring, clearing an app's cache and data regularly is recommended. And here's how it's done on the Galaxy Note 20. To get started, access the app's viewer by swiping up from the bottom of the home screen. The next screen showing different app icons is called the Apps Viewer. The icons you see here serve the shortcut controls to access a certain app on your device. Tap the Settings icon to proceed. The Settings menu will load up on the next display. Here, you will see a list of basic and advanced features and settings to manage. Scroll down to view more items. Then, tap Device Care. Another screen will launch with four main directories, namely, the Battery, Storage, Memory, and Security. Tap Storage to continue. The Storage menu opens next. On this menu, you will see the amount of used and available storage on your device. Different storage directories are also lined up at the lower section. Tap Advanced to view more advanced storage components. Another window opens with more storage details. Here, you will get a full grasp on how much storage is used up by the system memory, photos and videos, games, movie, other apps, and files. To proceed with this demo, tap Other Apps. A list of different apps will populate the next display. Scroll down or up to view the app that you'd like to clear cache and data on. In this demo, we'll select Outlook as an example, so just tap the selected app to view more details of its storage consumption. On the next screen, storage information will be displayed. At the bottom section, you'll see the clear data and clear cache commands. Tap Clear Cache to instigate wiping of all stored cache from the Outlook app. All temporary data stored on the application, including any corrupt information will then be erased, except all saved data. Tap Clear Data to permanently delete all stored data from the app, including files, settings, accounts, databases, logins, and others. If prompted, read and review the information, and then tap OK to confirm. After clearing cache and data, the app will download every bit of information it needs like what it did the first time you used it. Any app problems attributed to some erratic files or bugs in the app will then be rectified. To clear cache and data from other apps, just repeat the same steps. Clearing cache and data does not uninstall the app, so there's no need to worry of having to re-download or reinstall the application. And that's it. If you think that this video is helpful, we would appreciate it if you can like, share, subscribe, and hit the notification bell for more videos in the future. Thanks for watching.